you too. Anime family was good with it, everybody. It's your boy Lose V Bree, and I'm back with another video. Now I noticed something. I went back and I watched my videos on the power scaling. Me reacting to Seth the programmer, and I realized something. I was being too counter argumentative, you know, like I wasn't really listening to what he had to say. Every time he said something, I just tried to come back with a rebuttal, you know, like I wasn't really trying to understand what he was trying to tell me, you know? And I feel like that's not the right way to do things. My goal is to actually understand power scaling. I gotta listen to one of the pros, you know? I gotta listen to someone who actually knows what he's talking about, which is sad. But at the same time, I'm not a big Seth fan, you know? Simply because I don't agree with the shit that he says. But that's why today I'm gonna be listening to somebody else. Now, somebody recommended this video to me and then I realized like, hey, hold on. That's my favorite YouTuber. My favorite anime YouTuber. He made a video on power scaling. It's specifically Dragon Ball, but he made a video on power scaling in Dragon Ball Z. And I'm like, look, for this video, I'm gonna react to it. I'm gonna actually listen to what he has to say. I'm not gonna, you know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna throw out no unnecessary hate. I'm not gonna try to rebuttal everything he's saying. I'm gonna really try to get behind. I'm gonna try to back him up for this video, okay? So for this video, I'm gonna put myself in the shoes of somebody else, like one of the other power scalers. I'm gonna, I'm gonna act like I actually agree with everything that he says. You get me? So let's see how this goes. Maybe my mind will be changed. But let's get straight into this video. I made a video talking about why Kaba came with kid, but people let me have it, and I still think <laughs> this one of the, this one of the, fuck immediately, man. Y'all know Kid Buu is my favorite villain in Dragon Ball Z. He's my favorite character in Dragon Ball Z. So when somebody already, you know what I'm saying? He's starting with Kid Buu and Kaba beating Kid Buu <laughs> on drugs. <laughs> but he agreed with me. And I'm agreeing with everything he said. He said that he said he made a video on why Kaba can't beat Kid Buu. You know what I'm saying? So right now, for this moment, we both agree. But like I said, I'm not going to keep on pausing this video, y'all. Let me just play it through. Stand strong on that. Tell me, no, nah, bro. See, that's where you're wrong. Because Vegeta clearly stated when him and Kaba fought that they were even on each other's base level. And Vegeta's base level is stronger than everybody in Z. So that means Kaba is too. And I'm like, Vegeta said that, right? Yeah, Vegeta. The same Vegeta who told me on Namek that he was going super super <laughs> every next episode of Dragon Ball. I thought that he was going super on Namek until I seen Goku go super. Since we want to talk about Super Vegeta, he got his ass super whoop by Rakumo on Namek. <laughs> If you play any Dragon Ball Z game, you you know that Raccoon, you do well. It was a it was really hard beating this man in all of the games. But the hardest game ever, the hardest mission ever was lasting 90 seconds with Kid Buu and Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkaichi 1. You didn't have to win, you didn't have to hurt him, you just have to last 90 seconds. And it was hard to last 10. But let's continue. I would agree with everything he's saying right now. Gohan 
go fight. Because Sprite don't know how for how long he's still dying to Kill his shit. All right, if you say so, me, hell no. Not Kakarot Kid. Got Kakarot Kid fighting for his survival. The same homie he just died. And all of a sudden, kabow, his kid get popped. Cell came out with a dude on the right on the red ribbon. Well, Virginia rushed him instantly. Powered up those super and started spinning his butt. He didn't want to run that round with Cell. He the prince of all saying, see, he just got out the time chamber. Ferguson ain't do nothing. Ta -ta 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 None of that was worth anything. He had his time chamber training and came back with the, the death of his son on his conscience cell pop up. <laughs> Boy, if you get your dumb ass on, Mr. Perfect, <laughs> wow! <laughs> Drop his ass. And then try to... <laughs> You're dead charged up on that father and son moment. Took my boy Gohan arm out real quick. Damn, you know, imagine getting saved by the Gohan. You supposed to be the prince of all saints. You can still say those chunks, but nonetheless, Gohan wasting it on on this weak ass power show with Vegeta, man. Vegeta ain't even know his son can go Super Saiyan. The same Vegeta who was, yeah, this grown man gravity. What you trying to do? Go back in there and play with Gohan. Gravity affects Saiyans. I tried to tell y'all this. Y'all was like, no, that's Cap. That's Cap. So Fuji Tora is affecting the sand. I'm just saying. You hear me? I'm just saying. Go super brown. What the chunk get that? Put it up there to Hey, hey, put it up there to How could he super sand? Step into the grand tour, grand tour, grand tour. He's doing the dash. I can't believe it. Power scaling. You know, they say everybody's super far stronger than everybody in Z. And I don't mean everybody get whooped. There's a lot of people stronger than me, and I still beat their ass. But if we talking DBZ wise, Boo bounced back and kind of showed up the watch. What the hell is he? He messed around, gave him a little doggy biscuit, Boo, a little nudge off the tree of Mighty. Ha, go quick snack and he snack him. Boom, boom, boom. Got big and Boo automatically opened the eyes on him. My dick, yo. Shot in gun. Let the good hands come in. <laughs> yeah, everybody's stronger than Z the Super Hey, What's up, Bing, 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 on bumpers. He hey, all of me, Bing, Man, Bing, Bing, Bing. They could have put him in the tournament if I would have been over fast. He threw ass and Boo still bounced back. So all that super characters are far stronger than Z characters. Hey, this Boo Blast might say otherwise. Damn. If that's the case, on. are they stronger or is it just the abilities they have make them formidable opponents? I'll be the saying that. Whooping up on Kaba. Her name was like Mona or something. You can't spell Mo without her name. I remember that for sure. But she was working Kaba. Then she flexed everybody in Z by y'all logic. Because this is what Vegeta said on base level. And then Kaba is easy. But hey, your boo is shaking hips. <laughs> Uh, the Shakira, Damn, it must really, really, really be tough being a Vegeta fan. You feel me? Like I like Vegeta over Goku. Like I'm Team Vegeta, but they they're not my favorite character. My favorite character is Kid Buu. So you know what I'm saying? If your favorite character is Vegeta, it must really, really be tough because he is like the the team's punching bag. You feel me? Just to show how how strong Goku is, they let Vegeta get punched on. But let's continue this. Kid Boo hitting his little, little dance home. But I'm agreeing with everything he's saying. I told y'all I'm going to try for this video. I'm going to try to agree with everything that the man is saying. And I'm doing that. You know what I'm saying? And and I honestly really do agree with everything he's saying. Just Majin Boo in general. Big Boo, Skinny Boo, Kid Boo. <laughs> any Boo really show for Vegeta that trauma. So to hear going on power scale for the wait, 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 wait. all of these fights. Yeah, <laughs> race popped in the early That's Majin early too. Episode. One, yeah, yeah. So when Raditz got in the episodes, his power level was like this. And then we learn a few episodes later, the Cybermen got a power level. This like what y'all be trying to tell me. This what Seth tried to tell me. So can we say they'll take a one-on-one -on -one with Raditz off of that strength? And if so, yeah, yeah my boy Monaka, the strongest character, and Doug Beard said so. Monaka can't spell his name without Mo. I <laughs> swear to God. <laughs> And he was really trying. Was solo everyone in Z, man. And this beer's level of power scale. And this spark C will be thing, man. That same base Goku will solo everybody in Z. And I hurt your butt. Wow. Oh. with the dynamite punch system to the news lead. They had a good game of J Stars going. But could you look oh, at yes, the Oh, yes, sir. Bing, 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 bing. You know, you lucky you ain't. Bow, 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 bow. This is the same shit. Man. I'm agreeing with everything he's saying. I'm letting y'all know that. Cell 
Don't go too far. So in the grand scheme of things, hurt you after knocking out Antoine Tays, Damn, Cuzzo dropped her ass. We're going on power scale. Hey, Vegeta, just because your dad get picked on, he's a little championship nug, man. Let me just a little quick, uh, in the cheek, man. You a winner, I'm a winner, and one hit on you. I'm going to let you go first. He's letting the youngin go first. Oh, man, that guy. Hey, don't hurt you. Hey, let's go. Put your back. Championship nerds, huh? Donkey mouth ass boy. By scaling logic, So that means Hercule is like the strongest person in Z. No cap going off of scaling logic because the shit was actually happening in the show. It wasn't filler. It was happening. Going based off of scaling logic, that means that Hercule is whooping everybody because that Nick Kid Boo, that Nick Majin Boo whooped on Vegeta. And if Hercule whooping Boo, then that means Hercule whooping Vegeta. You know what I'm saying? No, I'm saying, and if Hercule whooping Goku, we seen him punch Goku, you know what I'm saying, you know what I'm saying, I'm just saying, we were here. Nah, this is all for jokes, y'all. <laughs> you know I'm saying, I do agree with everything he's saying, but of course, obviously, Hercule, you, you know, obviously, but, you know what I'm saying, this is all for jokes, this is a very good video, I thought I should share it with y'all. <laughs> This man is my favorite YouTuber, my my favorite anime YouTuber, Molar. Go check him out, because his shit is lit. His content is funny as hell. But yeah, like I said at the beginning, I was going to agree with everything that this man said. I really do agree with everything that this man said. That's factual. But that's it for this video, y'all. Remember that you have the ability to make me famous. You had a power to put some bread in my hands. And all you gotta do is get this video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. And one more thing I gotta say. Thank you for the 4K, baby. I really appreciate y'all, man. And I'm and every time we ask for a certain amount of likes, y'all exceed expectations. We asked for 250, y'all gave us 860 in one day. Damn. I really do appreciate y'all. Now I'm gonna I'm give y'all another challenge, but y'all might not do this because you know we this we we not really dissing Dragon Ball Z. We dissing Vegeta. You know what I'm saying? In the Dragon Ball Z power scaling, but I'm still gonna ask for some likes. Let's see how lit the anime family is. Can y'all get this video to 500 likes? Oh, preach! <laughs>